Total Solar Eclipse on Monday, April 8th this year is really exciting because it's a chance to see a total solar eclipse in your backyard. Otherwise, usually people have to travel thousands of miles to see one of these events. There's a whole travel industry built around observing solar eclipses because they are that awe-inspiring. And I imagine that there are going to be hundreds of thousands of people that will descend upon Indiana to observe the uh, eclipse. All of our planetarium events are really focused on the weekend before the eclipse. During the eclipse itself, we are encouraging people to take the information they learned at our eclipse events and experience the eclipse in their own backyard or at the destination that they choose. As a teacher, it's an opportunity where everybody has this natural curiosity and they want to learn more. And that's what we're excited about experiencing again. Our mission here at Ball State is education, and so we want to be able to engage the community and anyone else who might be coming to Muncie to observe the eclipse. I encourage everyone to go out and learn a little bit about the sun, learn a little bit about eclipses. Everything I've heard from people who travel around the world to see eclipses is that that is an emotional event and it's, it's going to be spectacular. Solar eclipse glasses are incredibly important. They cannot be created in your house or anything like that. You have to buy certified solar eclipse glasses. They let in one one thousandth of a percentage of sunlight. Basically, they block enough sunlight so that your eyes are safe. Really check out our website, bsu.edu slash solar eclipse 2024. It has all the information you need to know, but really basically you need those solar eclipse glasses. You need to know that traffic will be happening a lot on that day. Uh, if it's sunny, don't forget your sunscreen.